capable combatant. Everyone here in Lestalem is counting on you to keep him safe. If you think you're safe out here, think again. You'd better get inside while you still have a chance. Some kids pelted me with cans and called me a dirty niff. I don't blame them, though. They're just repeating what they hear. They called off the search for Prince Noctis. Without our king or crystal, we've got nothing left. I've seen a lot of crowns guards in my day, but none of them can hold a candle to Kor. He's in a league of his own. I thought the demons would disappear once the Empire fell, but they've only grown in numbers since then. Not to mention that the knights have gotten longer, too. The connection's so clear at this point that even the deniers have changed their tune. If you believe what it says in the cosmogony, then one day the king will rise up and rend the darkness. But it's hard to find comfort in fairy tales when said king is M.I.A. If the demons really are averse to the light, then they must be having the time of their wicked little lives right now. Unfortunately, we humans aren't faring quite as well. This is the only place we can live nowadays, and even then, it's not easy. But the people of Lestalem, the ones we're fighting to protect, they haven't thrown in the towel just yet, so neither should we. <laughs> people call me a pessimist. But what's there to be optimistic about now? Insomnia's fallen and the king's dead. At this point, there's nowhere left for us to go but straight to the grave. Now the marshal wanders around like a pathetic patrolman. Don't get me started about the prince's royal retainers. Bunch of bums, if you ask me. Thank you. Good luck. Be careful out there. We're counting on you. We're lucky to be living in the light of the meteor. It's the only thing keeping the demons at... Here you go. I can't thank you enough. Nowadays, Lestolem's known as the City of Light, the last beacon of hope left for mankind. That's why everyone's gathered here. Refugees are pouring into the city from all corners of Eos, and it's our job to keep them safe from the demons. We glaives fight for hearth and home, and this is our home now. Nowadays, Lestolem's known as the City of Light, the last beacon of hope left for mankind. That's why everyone's gathered here. Refugees are we glaives fight for Relax. You can rest easy now. Although you might want to thank the guy who brought you here. Anyway, I'd better get a move on. Wouldn't want to face the wrath of Kor the Impatient. Oh, and here's something for the road. I don't even get a thanks, Libertus. Or did you forget my name? Huh. Guess you still got a lot to remember. If you're looking for Prince Noctis' royal retainers, you're not gonna find all of town. Said something about fending off the demons. If you're lucky, maybe... You want weapons? We got lots of them.
Hey, come again. How in tarnation is a man supposed to get his work done without any power? Man, what's up with the power? Can't they do something about the power? Man, what's up with the power? Anything I can assist with? So you're the glaive everyone's been talking about. Pleasure. Name's Jean. I work for Exynerus. We take the meteor shards that glaives like you collect and turn them into electricity. Pretty cool, right? All we need is enough light to drive away the demons. If you've got any bright ideas about where to send power next, feel free to share. Future is bright. Best of luck. Those exit. I'd say they got your good side, wouldn't you? Glad you like it. I'll make sure to give the cameraman a raise. Oh, right. I suppose I ought to introduce myself. Viv Dorden, president and CEO of Meteor Publishing Incorporated. You see, that shot of you made quite a splash among the locals, so I was hoping you might let us take some more. Our resident cameraman will just follow you around and snap some shots. But don't worry, he won't get in your way. Come on, the public is eating you up. Let's give him another helping. I'll hold on to all the photos my guy takes. If you see one you like, I can frame it for you. I remember watching Leviathan rise out of the water that day. You would have thought it was Shiva the way I was frozen in place. The folks at Exynerus have given us hunters unlimited access to their cable cars. Believe me, riding the ropeway's a lot safer than trekking out to the boonies on foot. First, you'll need permission to board, of course, but I'm sure Monica would be happy to help you with that.
I'm not complaining about our rations. I'm glad we have them, but what I wouldn't give for a couple of those skewers they used to sell in the marketplace. The folks at Exynerus were kind enough to hire me right after I immigrated to the city. The work isn't easy, but it sure beats sitting. What did you think of the front gate? That was all Sid's idea. He insisted on it. A classic like her had to be on display for everyone to see. We could always use more media shards. If you happen to come across any while you're out in the field, could you bring them back here? You know about those demons called bombs, right? Wouldn't it be cool if we could build an engine capable of harnessing their combustive force? The Laville is off limits to regular civilians for the time being. The city wants to make sure we save space for refugees. of what we can do. Bye now. Hey, you're a member of the Kingsglaive, right? I don't mean to bother you out of the blue, but would you be interested in buying some used clothes? It's for a good cause. I mean, they're not all used. I actually sewed some of them myself. Anyway, have a look if you got a second. Hey there! Come again! Will you lend us a hand? Thank you. Take care out there.
Glad you made it back. Dinner is served. One can't wage war on an empty stomach, so eat up. Good to see you. I'd say the future is bright. Say hi to your pals. Ready to get powered up? We really owe you one. See ya. Say, ain't you one of them's on Reggie's security detail? You didn't help him much, but maybe you can do something for me now that that comes from our powers back. You see that baby over there? I was using her to remodel weapons for a spell, but she ain't getting much love nowadays. Do me a favor and put the old girl to work. Got her all tuned up for you. 